So, you want to subdivide. So we're going to tab into edit mode. And we're going to keep the default cube exactly as it is. Okay? I see a default cube. You're just trying to live. Now, the traditional way to do it is to right click and subdivide right there. You can also come up here to edge, subdivide, and the same thing happens. Okay, let's say we just want to subdivide this edge right here. We can go right mouse S and it's subdivided. Okay, right mouse button S. Okay, now what's cool about subdivide is that to subdivide an edge is the same process as subdividing a face. We have the face selected, right mouse button S. And now take a look. We got all that new geometry. Now say you want more, right? Say you want more than just a simple edge or a simple face. You want to subdivide the whole thing. Well now, so now you might need to come over to the modifier properties over here and add a subdivision surface modifier. And this adds subdivisions over the whole thing, okay? And you can add this up. You can add however many levels you want. You can make it really involved and complex. And now, you know, when you move it, you can move the whole thing. So we started with a simple cube, and now adding a subdivision surface modifier to the whole thing, we get a lot more geometry. And to get rid of it, you can very simply just X out on it. And we're back with the default cube. Now get back out there, and I'll see you in the next one.